In this demo, we're going to update an ISM repository with changes we've made to one of the floor levels in RAM Concept. There are three changes we've made at the third story in RAM Concept that we want to update the ISM repository with. Slab reinforcing, the removal of beams, and a reduction in slab thickness. We'll use the command update repository that is available under the sync ISM options in RAM Concept. When reviewing the changes, it's a good idea to group them by types that, so that there is less to look at at one time. The first thing we'll accept is the slab reinforcing we designed. This is a type of concentrated surface rebar. We select all those objects that were added and set them to accept. You can see that RAM Concept made a revision to the concrete material, but that's not something we need to bring in to the ISM repository, so we're going to keep those set to reject. The change also affects the members that use the concrete material. I'm going to narrow the list here to only the objects that were deleted, which will make it easier to find the list of beams that I removed. I'll set all of these to accept. Since we added reinforcing, a steel material object associated with the reinforcing was also created, and I need to accept this also. The last thing for us to accept is the slab revision. This takes special consideration because there were two changes we made to the slab and RAM concept. The first was a revision to the vertices of the slab. These were relatively minor changes we made to the slab outline so that the model ran without meshing problems in RAM concept. These changes don't need to be committed to ISM since they are relevant only within RAM concept. So we'll leave the location property of the surface member object set to reject. The second change is the reduction in the slab thickness. We do want to accept this change so that it can be incorporated by other project team members once it's in the ISM repository. Once we have everything set, we can click Preview to visually verify the state of the new model. Finally, we accept update to finalize the updating of the ISM repository. Other ISM-enabled applications linked to this ISM repository can now be updated with these changes.